Good morning guys, welcome to the video. My name's Amanda, I'm a third year vet student and welcome to a productive day in vet school. Oh, that is a cute puppy. It is currently Wednesday, October something. Thing. But we just got back from an extra long weekend. It was Canadian Thanksgiving So we got a couple days off after the weekend, which was super nice and I enjoyed every second of it But the reason why today needs to be a super productive day is because Thanksgiving is now over and if you go to OVC, you know exactly what that means But if you don't go to OVC and you're thinking Amanda, what are you talking about? Basically after Thanksgiving it hits the fan in second year and again this year after Thanksgiving is basically when our midterm season starts and I shouldn't even call it midterm season anymore because we basically have exams at least once a week from right after Thanksgiving all the way until April. So not ideal. Knowing that that's what happened in second year, I made sure to enjoy every second of downtime that I had this year. So I really have not done a ton leading up to this point. So now that Thanksgiving is over and we have our first midterm next Monday and it's an exam that I'm gonna have to study a lot for, I need need to have a productive day today. It is currently 7 30. I need to be on campus in about an hour so I'm gonna go ahead get ready try and make a fancy coffee this morning because I found a recipe on my Instagram and then we will head to campus. two hour lab this morning. So I think I'm gonna go work um, on campus for a little bit, try and get some lectures done before I go for lunch with a friend, which I'm super excited about. So hopefully uh, this will be productive. This will be my first time working on campus since first year. So I actually decided to come work outside for a little bit. I was getting kind of claustrophobic in those little pods upstairs and it's such a nice day out and I'm trying to enjoy the weather because you know what? It's gonna be snowing before you know it. So I'm gonna get a little bit more work done and then I'm gonna head for lunch. Hopefully you guys can hear me okay because I'm sitting right by the road, but I'm actually studying for my midterm next Monday. There is so much content on this midterm and it's almost all about pigs, which I clearly don't know a ton about. Um, so I'm starting to study for that now and I am already intimidated by this material, so wish me luck. Also, I forgot to mention our lab this morning made me just not want to go back to in person. I love learning online. I'm fine with labs, but this was just like going through cases sitting in a classroom and I'm going to say it, I never want to go back to in-person learning. I just finished up my study session. I was actually pretty productive. I got through a couple lectures for the midterm, so that's making me feel good. And I don't know if I mentioned it, but I'm actually going for lunch with a friend from undergrad and we're going for sushi, so I'm super excited because I am starving. Also, sorry if the video and audio quality has not been very great from the clips from this morning. I'm too scared to bring my camera to campus. Um, it's weird enough me talking to my phone on campus, so I definitely don't want to bring my camera. Um, but as soon as I get home, I'll be switching to my camera, so hopefully it'll get a little bit better for you guys. <laughs> I'm finally home from lunch with my friend. I am so full. I feel like I'm gonna explode So I need to take my jeans off ASAP I have a class later on this afternoon But I'm gonna try and get through a couple more lectures for my midterm before that class Because um, I actually have a pretty busy night tonight as well So hopefully I can check off a couple more of those lectures so that I have less to do this weekend Been waking up feeling low You're on my mind like all of the time, but just so despicable I've been studying for about an hour now and I have class in a little bit, but I realized I decorated my apartment for fall slash Halloween and I never showed you guys So I'm gonna show you that now because I love it. Okay, so we've got the fall leaves up there um, Don't mind that still have to put some pictures in there, but then I got a blue pumpkin How cute is that and then we got even more fall colors over here Another blue pumpkin. Can you tell I like blue? Going on there. Up on the office door. And then I got the cutest little pumpkin for my office space as well as for my desk. 
Look at how cute it is. My place is feeling super cozy and honestly, I really enjoy working here, which is another reason why I don't wanna go back to in-person classes. Cause look at, I don't have little mini pumpkins when I go to school. Okay, it is 5.30 now. I've officially finished classes for the day. However, at six o'clock, we have a meeting with our whole class and it's going over our fourth year and all of our rotations and what to expect with that. So I definitely have to go to that meeting. Um, we have a couple of these throughout the year and I will be honest, they're stressing me out a little bit because I can't believe fourth year is actually happening. Um, I can't believe we're actually gonna go out and be practicing and working and be doctors and it's a lot, but um, it's giving me a lot to look forward to. We're starting to talk about planning our schedules and what rotations we're gonna be doing. So that part is pretty exciting, but it's just crazy how fast this degree has gone and I can't believe I'm in like the final stretch of it. So I am going to go to that meeting Actually, I don't think I've told you guys about my externship yet. So maybe after the meeting, I'll tell you guys about that. And then I actually have a hockey game tonight. So I will talk to you right before I leave for that game. Okay, it is much later now. I finished the externship meeting. Honestly, it wasn't as stressful as I thought it was gonna be. It was just about submitting forms for our externship. Um, that's what I was gonna tell you guys about is I have finally secured an eight week externship for next summer. So I will be doing my mixed animal externship from May to July. Um, so that's what this meeting was about. Just finalizing the papers for that and submitting what stream we're gonna go into so it wasn't actually as stressful as I thought it was gonna be anyway I have a little bit until hockey so I'm gonna grab something to eat quickly and then it will actually be time for me to go get ready for hockey so enjoy the clips from hockey and then I'm gonna wrap up this video it is nine o'clock I'm heading to hockey our games this year are all super late nine o'clock is the earliest game we have which is not ideal since I'm normally in bed by 10 o'clock but I like playing hockey so much that I suck it up once a week and I go play because it's honestly so much fun and this is like my favorite part of the week it is such a stress relief so i try not to be a grandma like once a week and actually go play hockey Hey guys, it's now the next day. I got back from hockey late last night, so I wanted to wait until it was light out to wrap up today's video. Basically, as I was driving to hockey last night, I started thinking about how I didn't really have as productive as a day as I wanted to. And the reason why I was feeling like that was because I only really got through two and a half lectures and my midterm on Monday is on 22 lectures. So in the grand scheme of things, not super productive when it came to studying, but I really need to stop associating my productivity with just schoolwork because yesterday I had a really busy day. I had a lot of things on my calendar and I got all of them checked off. I got through all of them. So sitting in the car last night, I was like, oh, should I even post this video? Because to me, it didn't feel like a typical productive day because I wasn't super productive when it came to the school side of things. But I am slowly realizing that I need to be a little bit easier on myself in that sense because productivity is going to look different for every person and is gonna look different every single day. Some days a productive day is eight hours of studying, but other days like yesterday, productivity is making time to spend time with my friends and making time throughout the day to do something active like go play hockey. So if you take anything from this video, it's that productivity isn't just how well you study or how much work you get through that day. Productivity is taking care of yourself and making sure you do things throughout the day that are benefiting you as a whole. So there you guys have it. That is a productive day in vet school. I'm keeping the video titled as that because yesterday was productive. I got a lot of stuff done. I checked a lot of stuff off a to-do list and although maybe it wasn't your typical productive day in vet school, it was still a pretty productive day for me as a person, not just as a vet student. So with that being said, I hope you are having a productive day, whatever that might mean to you. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one. Bye!